This is Ayn Rand's answer to a question posed during an interview about 19th century robber barons. What is antitrust law really directed against? It is uh, directed against the ablest and the most successful members of industry. You're speaking, of course, of the antitrust laws. The antitrust laws are the instrument of government control and coercion over all business. They are, as every lawyer knows, a mixed, undefined, undefinable mess of contradictions, which is in such a state that every businessman in the country can be prosecuted as a criminal at any moment at the discretion of the government because he breaks some law or another the moment he goes into business. Laws which are contradictory so that if he complies with one law, he simultaneously breaks another. What the antitrust laws have done is to grant the government an arbitrary power to crack down on any industrialist. And you have certainly seen the last two administrations today using that power, not for purposes of protecting competition, which is a contradiction in terms, but for purposes of coercion and compulsion on general control of business politically, quite unrelated to the issue of competition. I want to stress that a competition, a free competition enforced by law is certainly a contradiction in terms. The only protection of competition is a free market without any controls, whatever. When government controls enter, they work to the advantage, again, of any in, an enterpriser or industrialist with government pool. Any man who cannot make it on the free market or who cannot compete on merit runs to the government and invokes the antitrust law against his abler and more successful competitors. So that the net result of the antitrust laws has been only the protection of mediocrity and the destruction of ability and success.